I'm going to move to Park Wahlberg. Okay. Uh, it is called Wonderland. They might change the title. Uh, it's coming out Q1, as executives like to say. Uh, and it's based on... There was a show in the 80s called Spencer for Hire, and it's based on this series of books. And he's like a guy that was a cop, and now he's taken justice into his own hands. And it's directed by Peter Berg, who is lovely. It's got Winston Duke, and it's got Alan Arkin, and it's got me. Whoa. And it's really... It's cool, because it's like... It's a real role. And... Uh, in the movie, it takes place in South Boston, as, as we do. And, um, as the, Mark does. As Mark does. And I remember the audition, and I never book anything. Uh, that's why I write my own things, because I just, I just don't. You, do you audition a fair amount, though? So much. Oh, really? It is really, it's a, it's a, a game of consistency and numbers, because eventually you're going to get something. Right. Um, I just always assume because you write your own stuff, because you're always touring, that you just uh, didn't... You no, know, you could get I, your own sketch show or your own talk show. Nobody but wants you didn't to hear really about wanna... the auditions for these like huge movies that I didn't get or the TV shows I didn't get. And also stand up, you know, it's it it's so good to me. Yeah. Um, and I wrote my own movie that we just finished. We have a distribution deal with parent uh, with oh fuck with Universal. Whoops, a Daisy. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Universal, but it's really exciting because we finished it and I wrote it. The Mark Wahlberg movie is this huge Netflix movie, and the audition. Um, they said no Boston accents. And I read the lines and I remember thinking, nobody who speaks like this isn't from South Boston. Like I invoked St. Jude at one point, or like St. Christopher, like no one does that. I tried it in like different accents, like unless you're like Irish Catholic from South Boston. So I did an accent in the audition. I watched like a little bit of Amy Adams and the fighter and I was like, I got this. And I went in and, I was, and they said no accent, but I did anyway. And then I got a phone call from Mark Wahlberg I was in a hotel room in Boston doing an event, and they were like, Mark wants to talk to you. I'm like, he's calling to say, you embarrass Boston. Please don't ever audition. And he called, and he was like, I like what you did? And I, I'm just trying to be cool. I'm like, awesome. Um, I went to Emerson. It's right here in Boston. Like, nobody cares. And he was like, so you ready to get crazy with us? And I was like, what does that mean? Does that mean I have the gig? He's like, yeah, we'll see you in a couple of months. And I screamed bloody murder. Like, you know, in your career, you hold on. You're like, one day I'm going to get to have that scream of relief. And that was it. And we made this movie. And it's really exciting. 